using the Audacity AutoDuck effect. Audacity is a free and open source multi-track audio editor and recorder available for computers running Windows, Linux, and Mac, both the Intel and M1 slash M2 versions. The duck effect is something I use to automatically adjust any background music for my commentary when I make YouTube videos. I would imagine there are other uses for it, but that's my scenario and that's what we will describe here. After recording the main audio track, the commentary track in my case, I edit and process it as needed, removing ums and ahs, heavy breathing, weird pauses, etc. You want this process to be completed before using AutoDuck. Your commentary should be ready to go at this point. Import your background music audio. I'll refer to this as the background track. The first unselected audio beneath the selected background track acts as the control track. As previously mentioned, in my scenario, the control track would be the spoken commentary. If you need to move the background track up so that it's on top, as described, do that before trying to apply the auto duck. Apply auto duck to the background track by selecting the track or a region of it and applying the effect. I found the default settings to be fine, but you can adjust them if needed. After AutoDuck processes the background track, you'll notice the waveform appears significantly different. You can then play back your tracks together and adjust the overall volume of the background in relation to the rest of the recording to get a pleasing effect. Audacity 3.13 has been released. It features the following improvements. Made it harder to accidentally create loop regions when attempting to use Timeline Quick Play. You can always go back and undo or adjust the auto duck effect. When completed, you should have your spoken commentary accompanied by background music that decreases in volume when you are speaking, just like you're hearing now. You can then import your audio and use it as needed on your video. I have some links below in the video description for Audacity itself and some other helpful information. As always, thank you for watching and I hope this was helpful for you.